So, all right, here we go. Part five of the knowing. Don't look up. Is Apophis is what is found in my book. And what we've just been going through in these other parts on this double-sided whiteboard. Children of Men. Now they staggered the release dates. So I'm going to explain that here. First release was the 3rd of September 2006, Italy. At one point, the last release on the, on the IMDB was this date. And that time frame between... The first and the last was 4,080 days. They've recently had three more release dates. The final release date that is up there still to this day is the 10th of October 2019 in the Philippines. And that marks from the first release being in Italy to the last release, first and last, Revelation chapter 1, God says of himself, I'm the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last, Satan, Lucifer, the devil, the dragon, Antichrist, son of perdition, man of sin, 666 man, whatever you want to call him, from the Bible, take your pick, wants to be the first and the last, right? So first and the last of the children of men, Satan, Lucifer, the devil, wants to be the leader. Well, he is currently, according to the Bible, he's the prince of the power of the air. 1318 later is the last release. 13 years, one month and eight days. Revelation 1318. See how it works, folks. Taglines in the movie. Bye. 2027, because that's when the movie's set in, covers the years 2009 to 2027, but it's set in 2027. Here's the taglines. No children, no future, no hope. The future is a thing of the past. The last one to die, please turn out the light. The last one, the last days of the human race. No child has been born for 18 years. He must protect our only hope. Who is this he? The year 2027. In 20 years, women are infertile, but all that can change in a heartbeat. It actually says in 20 years, women are infertile, no children, no future, no hope, but all that can change in a heartbeat because that changes with the birth of the black child in the movie. The cause of the infertility in the movie is unknown. Hmm. Yet they show, like I said previously, solar eclipse, the corona ring of a solar eclipse during flashes during this scene, during the uh, the trailers for the movie, same as they do in Knowing, there's no solar eclipse, there's no, uh, there is a solar flare, but there's no solar eclipse corona ring. In the movie Knowing it, the, 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 the cover for the movie Knowing has a corona ring solar eclipse as the logo. Go figure. More for the children of men. The year 2027, the days of the human race, the last days of the human race. No child has been born for 18 years. He must protect our only hope. Your baby is the miracle. This is what Michael Caine says in the movie. There's a scene. Go and watch the movie, please. Your baby is the miracle the whole world has been waiting for. The release date was January 5th. I've covered this extensively. Two days and 160 weeks. Two inauguration day of 2009. Barack Obama's inauguration, 666 days to... Election day, Obama, same day, Biden announced I'm running for the presidency to face off against the man born on the 216th day of the year, 216th day of the year, 6 times 6 times 6, Barack Obama, 4th of August, 61. Masonic ball held in his honor on inauguration day. Now, at the very last part of the movie, the credits are rolling. Final credits and the music starts playing and what starts playing I've covered this in previous videos music soundtrack end of film final credits start to roll John Lennon's song bring on the Lucy free the people free the people what does the lyrics say Now, think about this. Considering this is prior, 666 days prior, the movie trailer shows that this is the date comes out. 666 days later is election day of Barack Obama. So the lyrics in the song start. John Lennon, at the end of the credits, are starting to roll. We don't care what flag you're fly waving. We don't even want to know your name. We don't care where you're, where you're from. Or where you're going. All we need, all we know is that, all we know like that, is that you came. You're making all our decisions. Yeah. Henry Kissinger said of Barack Obama. 
You're going to fundamentally change America and then go on and change the whole world. You're making all our decisions. We have just one request of you, that while you're thinking things over, here's something you just better do. Free the people times three. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Free the people, free the people. That's where they get the free da, F-R-E-D-A. Free the people. All right, continuing on. Well, we were caught with our hands in the air. Oh, yes, 2008 they were. GFC, remember that? Don't despair. Paranoia is everywhere. We can skate. We can shake it with love. Oh, yeah, free love, because John Lennon was all into that hippie movement and Woodstock and free love and all of that. No consequences. Do it that will. Does the whole of the law, Alistair Crowley, when they were scared. So let's shout it aloud like a prayer. We understand your paranoia, but we don't want to play your game. You think you're cool and know what you're doing. 666 is your name. Yes. Thank you. 666 is your name. Your time is up. You better know it, but maybe you don't realize, you don't read the signs. Now, it says, well, you were... Gosh, I can't read my own writing. Were you caught with your hands in the, in the kill? Wow. Now, 2008 comes around, 2009 predominantly, and Barack Obama becomes known as the Drone King. He killed more people with drones in overseas countries than any other president before him. Were you caught... You were caught with your hands in the kill and you're going to swallow your pill as you slip and slide down the hill on the blood of the people you killed. John Lennon. Bring on the Lucy. And it says, what does it say? I didn't write it. Uh, it says, um, yeah, stop the killing, stop the killing. At the end of the lyrics of the song, your baby is the miracle the world's been waiting for. 666 days later, he comes into power as president. Children of men. Diego Ricardo, planner, king, Obama, born 48. 48 years old, 2009 movie. Diego Ricardo was born 2009. He dies 18 years, 4 months, 8 minutes, 20 days, 16 hours later in 2027. Youngest person on the planet to have died. Youngest person on Earth has died since the world's humanity became infertile since 2009. H1N1 flu. Barack Obama. Cover that in previous videos. Now, here's the connection between children of men. In the trailer, you clearly learn 18, 666-216, 48, 216. 38 minutes of terror. Hawaii false flag alert. Happened on the 13th of January, 2018. Oh, we had a guy in the control room who just accidentally pushed the button and there was 38 minutes of terror because... Hawaiians thought there was a false, that there was an alert on missiles were, rain, were, were on their way over to Hawaii from goodness knows where. Turned out to be 38 minutes of terror. CNN and all the mainstream news wrote it up as being. Just like Hillary Clinton came out of the Situation Room on, on 2nd of May 2011. That was the 38 most intense minutes of my life after they supposedly took out Osama Bin Laden in Pakistan with SEAL Team Seal Team 6. Remember that? 1848, 21 and 6. 1848, 21 and 6, really? System at play, folks. The system at play. And then we go to the Lahana fires. I covered this in the previous video. Obama's book. Just so you don't think I'm making up. Oh, why would you count 21 days plus 6 days just to get a 216? Well, why the heck would Obama write a book called The Promised Land about the first 27 months of his presidency, 21 plus 6. Come on, folks. Wisdom comes from counting. Revelation 13, 18. This is not rocket science, people. All right. In this case, exactly 666 days between... President Biden announcing going to run for presidency breaks down 84 weeks, 2 months and 16 days. 84, 216, 666. The man born on the 8th of the 4th, August the 4th, 216th day of the year, 6 times 6 times 6 equals the day that Barack Obama became president. Senator Obama announces his run for presidency just a few days after, in the next month, after Biden announced he was going to run 
for presidency. 84 later was the day that Obama stood on the Pergamon altar, the seat of Satan, Temple of Zeus, to receive his party's nomination at the Mile High Stadium in Denver, Colorado, with the mock Pergamon altar stage, which was based on the Pergamon altar museum in Berlin. People were all over this when it happened. Do they know that it was 80 weeks and four days since he announced he's going to run for presidency because he's the 666 man? My gosh. All right. It'll be part six. Thanks for listening.